The match function returns the position of an item within a range. The formula breakdown is lookup value, lookup array, and match type. What it means is we're looking up this value from this list or range of cells. The last option is return me the exact match. So usually the match function works is when you have two lists of data and you want to confirm whether items in list number one also are in list number two. Now I've got a small list here, but you can have a list that goes 100,000 rows down or more. But I'm going to show you how this works just using a small list here. So I've got stock list one and the price. And we've done a stock take cell here and it gives us the units. And I want to match, I want to see whether this stock list here is available in the stock take. So what we do is put in the match function and we're looking up the value. Well, we want to look up this value here. Where is our lookup array or table or list, whatever you want to call it. Let's move this away from here. It is in here. Okay, so it's all the way down here. And we can press F4 just to lock it in. And we want the exact match. Okay, and it says number two. So what it returns is, is the position within this list here where TAL2154 is located. Have a look here. TAL2154 is located in position number two. Now I'll put in these helper columns to just show you that it's there. Now let's drag this all the way down. And NA means that lap 5468 is not in this list. So it's not in the stock take, it's sold out. Tab 4577 is in position number one. So we can see here what's available and what's not. What we can do is with the NA is we can just say if error, then value if error, we can put in not available or or out of stock. Let's type in out of stock. And we can just double click and bring it all the way down. So you can see there it's out of stock. And if you want, you can put in a filter here, control shift L and just filter out out of stock and see what's available or the other way around. You want to see what's out of stock and we want to order these three here. So match function is great when you're comparing two lists and you want to find out the unique values between one list and the other.